Mm -hmm. A little crazy, but today is another motherfucking stripper vlog. We love stripper vlogs. I have a excuse me. Move my car. You already know what it is. Gotta move that car. Or a day. Or a day. Gotta move that car. Or a day. I would be so sad if I came outside and my car wasn't here. But a bitch made sure she got good parking yesterday. Oh, it's like even when you know you parked okay, you still get scared. Cause I come outside so often to my car not being here. I have time for it. But anyways, good morning. It's 11 o'clock. Gotta move my car right now. And actually, let me get in the car. Ooh. All right, so I'm getting in the car right now. I have to go get my tail light fixed because I pulled over almost two weeks ago. And if I don't get it fixed within two weeks, then I have to go to court for a tail light, and that's stupid. So let me just go handle that. It's literally like twenty dollars. Let me just go get that done, and then I need to um should have made breakfast, but I didn't want my I was wasting time because my cat was being so bad today. Then nigga threw all of my stuff that was in the closet into his litter box after he just took a shit. I'm just like the disrespect is. I'm sorry, you see the energy I got? Because I woke up and my cat was being bad today. Then I realized this nigga learned how to open the door. So he can open the door now. So, yeah, ain't no fucking stopping him. But, yeah, I am getting ready to go get that done. And then after that, I'm going to go to the stripper store because I need a new outfit. Like, I've been wearing the same three outfits and I've been dancing for about three weeks now. So I need a new outfit. And then I'm going back to work tonight in Brooklyn. I know, crazy. I haven't, I'm not sure if I've uploaded all the vlogs in order, but I think I will. Like, Anyways, I just started working at a new club and I was going to go work at my new club today because today is Friday. But the other club that I was working at before has been lit lately because they got new promoters. So I'm trying to go work there tonight because I know there's going to be money there. So I'm trying to go there tonight. I'm about to go get a new outfit and after I get my thing fixed. And then I'm going to do like two Instacart orders because a bitch needs some money. And then I'm going to um, get cash and come straight home. I need to be home. I'm trying to be home by 2 o'clock. So then I can take a shower and then get ready to leave again. Take a shower, feed my cat, and get on the road. But yeah, so let me go put in the... Did I bring my charger with me? Oh, I... Yeah, let me put the address in to the spot to go get my to Pet Boys. So I just pulled up to Pet Boys over here next to Staples. I'm about to go get <clears throat> my tail light fixed. And my cat, fuck it, my cat has been a menace lately. Like, anyways, my cat, he broke my headphones, which is fucking tragic. And I had an extra pair, I had a backup pair from my from this phone because the it's like I upgrade my iPhone whenever possible. And I always have like leftover stuff from my old iPhone because I don't break my parts. Like I normally, I never break a charger. I've never had a charger with a short in it. I've never broken my headphones. I just don't break my shit. I don't know. I think people be pulling the wire too hard or something. But my cat so meticulously and skillfully ripped and shredded my headphones. I don't even know how he did it. And he had them for like five seconds and did all that. But... Yeah, so I'm going to go on Staples and see if I can find a pair of wireless headphones. Not AirPods, because I'm not about to spend money on AirPods today when I have to pay bills today. I got to pay my rent today, so I'm not trying to buy AirPods today. But I need headphones. Like, it's been real hard. So I think I'm going to go in there and see if they have any um, wireless headphones. And I think that Cash App has, like, a boost at Staples, I think. So maybe I can get a little discount, which would be nice. But I'm about to go on the Pep Boys right now and check my car in. And then I'm going to go walk around Staples while my car's being serviced. So I'll see you guys in Staples. 
All right, so I'm in Staples now. I just dropped my car off. It only costs twenty five dollars. Just lit. Um, and now I'm in the headphone section. They don't have a Staples boost anymore, so I'm not really pressed on getting a discount anyway, which has been nice. But look at these. These AirPods are one fifty nine. The cheapest ones. Not today. I see me making a bag tonight. I feel like I need to go home and practice some moves instead of fucking going up doing the part. But a bitch needs some money, so I'm gonna be smart. I got these headphones right here. They're only sixty dollars. I have another exact similar pair for fifty dollars. I could get some regular $10 headphones. Let me look and I'll see. So I just finished getting my car service and I hope you can hear me because I got these like fake ass AirPods. One is charging right now, one is in my ear. They were only $30 and I got a protection plan on it because if they break, I want a new pair. Because yeah, I have a feeling that the headphone was falling out of my ear and it accidentally hung up because it has a button on it. But I was saying, I'm sure they're going to break soon. I mean, I hope they don't, but if they do, I would like another pair because, yeah, I can't be headphoneless until I can afford to get real AirPods. And honestly, they're just Turn like right AirPods. onto 4th Avenue. The difference is they're a little bigger. And I did have AirPods before, but I don't have them now, as you can see. But I'm on my way right now to the stripper store. I'm trying to find something that is bright and colorful. It could be a, a one piece, but I think I kind of want a two piece. I don't know. And then I also think I'm not going to go to work after. I'm going to maybe do one Instacart order, but I might not because it's already getting late and I forgot. I'm trying to be there by four o'clock, be there on time and work the full six hours so I can get all little bits of money that may possibly come. So, yeah. Let me get my ass on the fucking road right now. Welcome to the stripper house now. That's cool. I feel like I'm in here like once a week or something. And I got some cute ass shoes. I want shoes like this. I feel like these are official strippers. I'm gonna lose these headphones. I feel like everybody has that, but it's cute. But this is also really cute. All right, so I'm leaving the store now. I'm about to go home. Honestly, I think I hate these um, AirPod things. I might return them. They don't stay in my ear. Hold on. I don't know. Maybe it was just my mask that's like pushing on the back of my ear, but they would not stay in my ear, but it seems okay right now. But I just went in the store. I was gonna do Instacart, but I signed on. I didn't see anything and it's already 1-11. And I need to go home, eat something, take a shower, and get ready to go to work. So I think I'm just going to go straight home. But I got an outfit. It's cute. Um, I was having a hard time finding something. I think I might have to go to a new store because they didn't have that much stuff that I wanted. But when I was literally, I was about to get this other outfit. And I was walking towards the register and I saw this. And it's like, yes. Because I wanted something either blue or pink. But the top is perfection. The color is perfection. It's like a... I don't know, like the reflective blue iridescent. And the bottoms are cute too. I literally had those headphones for maybe 15 minutes. I already lost it. It fell under my seat and I can't reach it and I don't feel like looking for it right now. So I'll look for it when I park and when I get home. So I'm about to just drive home and get ready and eat. And yeah, I will see you guys probably when I'm on my way to work so let's go I just got out the shower 
I just packed my bag. Well, I literally packed my bag with everything except for my new outfit. So my new outfit, I just took all of my dirty clothes out of there because they need to get washed. Um, I put on deodorant and stuff. I just need to put on some pants and I'm ready to, oh, and feed my cat real quick. Let me do that right now. So yeah, and then I need to stop and take out some cash. I have cash here. Uh, I just, I wasn't trying to bring mad singles with me, you know? And I also don't really want to stop at the bank to get more, but I might. I'm also thirsty as hell. I'm so thirsty, but I'm craving juice. I'm gonna put a water bottle in my bag too. Just so I don't forget. I'm gonna close this now too because I'm gonna forget my tent. My plants that are growing in here when it's nighttime. It needs to be dark in there. So, yeah. Let's make sure it stays good. But yeah. I just need to get some cash, put some pants on, and I'm ready to walk out the door. I'm going to paint my toes at work. I'm going to do my hair at work. I'm going to do my makeup at work. If I do makeup today, I kind of wanted to do makeup, but me going to get my car fixed and stopping at the store to get a new outfit really cut my time short. And then my shower, it didn't even take a long shower, but... I was, you know, shaving and getting my life together. So I really have not had any extra time to do anything. And I'm trying to get there on time because now uh, tip out goes up if you're there late. So I might as well get there on time and get ready. Yeah. But yeah, that's all I need to do. I will see you in the car. Oh, also, I literally have like no weed. Like no weed. I was supposed to buy weed today but she texted me this morning at 10 telling me i could work so yeah when i get off of work i'm either going to have to drive to long island which i'm not trying to do or roll up some clips until the morning which sounds like a better idea because that's just so out the way for tonight but i'm babbling i like talking to y'all niggas i do so let me just put some pants on and get my ass out the door all right, I just got in the car. I'm turning it on now. I'm about to be on my way there. Uh, I need to charge my phone while I'm driving a little bit. And I didn't have to stop because I did have the cash. I had a $20 bill and 20s and singles. So at least I didn't give you 40 singles. I'm trying to be there on time. My only issue is I am parched. I just, damn, I forgot my water bottle. And I just cleaned my car out. I had like two extra water bottles. Like, ooh. And I just opened it. I'm about to start driving now. Put my phone on the charger and be on my merry little way. I'll see you when I get to work. And I think I'm not gonna smoke until I get there. Cause I barely have weed. And I pray to God, none of these bitches asked me to hit my shit. Pray to God. But yeah. All right, so I'm driving, I'm on my way to work. I know I said I wasn't gonna smoke on my way to work, but I found the clip in my ass. <laughs> I have such a fucking pothead. It's okay, whatever. Who cares? Anyway, I found a clip in my ashtray and I attached it to a filter. So, bitch, I'm gonna smoke on my way to work and then I'm gonna roll up while in 600 feet. Anyways, um, if I don't smoke, probably gonna be sitting in the corner all weird. But I always smoke before work. Besides the point, let me go. <laughs> what's up guys welcome back to my channel honestly i can't even remember if i um updated you guys when i got here um let's see i'm struggling it's not gonna work let's see can I film that? Whoop. I have a feeling 
turning this upside down i'm gonna have to flip this over but it's all right for now so anyways i don't know if i updated you guys when i first got to the club right now i'm sitting in my car i'm just waiting for my car to warm up a little bit and i'm rolling a little quick spliff but yeah um when i got to the club in case i didn't update you guys when i got to the club i um came in changed got dressed all the girls were here super good vibes like i'm grateful that all the girls that i've met at every club that worked so far which has only been two <laughs> they've all been so chill like there's never been no weird sketchy vibes about any of the girls so which is really awesome to be able to fucking at least be able to talk to your co-workers like we'll all be in there smoking together just talking shit just chilling but um the club got shut down tonight club got shut down why did the club get shut down honestly um i'm not even sure if i should like get all into detail like because really that's none of my business and i'm not trying to you know but bottom line short somebody came in somebody like from the state or from the city whichever came in and was like yeah nah this is not okay um apparently something happened prior in the week i wasn't working so i don't know and then um i guess they came to like check tonight and then yeah we got penalized and it got shut down the club is supposed to close at 10 like during covid right now the hours the hours just got restricted three weeks ago because at first the hours were closing at 12 already restricted because the club normally closes at 4 a.m it was closing at 12. so then from 12 it's getting shut down even further so now it's shutting down at um 10 p.m and now from 10 p.m the club's supposed to close at 10. And this guy came in he's walking around he's doing his thing it was 7 15 when we like came back on the floor because i went in the back to smoke came back on the floor around 7 15 ish 7 20 maybe we were out for about 10 minutes so around 7 30 it was cool we're sitting in the back and then she comes in the back and she lets us know like all right everybody has to get uh -huh, dressed right now because we just got shut down and we're all just looking at each other like honestly i'm thinking like oh we got shut down for the night like okay that's fine i'll be back tomorrow but like no we got shut down shut down like until further notice like i'm thinking until maybe next year so like yeah it's dead for the this club so now i only work at one club so now i have no choice but to make all my money at this new club that i got hired at which is fine by me the only thing is i just need to get crazy on the pole like that's my one thing i'm trying to get crazy on the pole and i know it won't be hard i'm about to buy a pole but yeah so tonight i'm about to continue this party i'm gonna go work at a second event at a private event um i'm not sure if i'm going to i know it's going to be in brooklyn for sure but i'm just not sure which part of brooklyn i'm gonna work in yet i'm really trying to stay in brooklyn i'm not trying to go to manhattan tonight at all and i'm already wearing my clothes under this so i'm not trying to take my clothes off and put them back on because it's already 8 right now or like it's close to 8 30 right now and the one of the events starts at 11 and the other one probably starts at midnight so i'm probably gonna have enough time to go home park make dinner and then leave again and i'm thinking i should drive tonight sometimes i don't like driving because i don't want to not be able to find parking but it's in brooklyn and I got my tail light fixed today, so I feel okay driving. Like, I'm not gonna get pulled over. Granted, my license is suspended, but I didn't get pulled over. And I don't think I will get pulled over because there's nothing wrong with my car. All my lights are good. I'm not gonna drive like a retard, and I'm gonna park where I need to park. So, um that's it for now um when i go back out tonight i will bring you guys along with all right let's go whole little spiel 
will be for our first report. But um, I am leaving the party right now. I barely recorded in the party because I was working. My straight hair, you, you guys can't even see this, is poofy, straight wear. You see that? Straight wear. Um, I am currently on my way home. Um, I'm leaving early because for one, I thought it ended at four. It doesn't end till seven. Turn right. I'm on my way home to, you know, honor those plans. But, um, yeah, it was lit in there. I didn't know. Like, and every time I tried to leave, niggas kept pulling me back. Literally, I got fully dressed, ready to walk out the door. I had the bag in my hand. And this guy stops me at the door. He's like, you can't leave before you give me a dance. I said, you want me to dance in my clothes, in my fucking t-shirt? and pants and he was like yeah i said okay nigga damn sure made it rain in my pants i just pulled these dollars out of my jeans like i don't even know if i got them all but whatever um yeah tonight was honestly probably the best night i've had dancing so far which is amazing if i stayed all night oh i know i, I know i could have made a bag i know i could have made a bag i made definitely made some money which is great because since my club got shut down and I made zero dollars at work, like, I'm just grateful I made anything, but I'm about to go home and get some rest, and that is it for this stripper vlog. I might do a money count. I might not. I don't know. I'm tired, but thanks for watching. We got another one coming soon. I'm working again tomorrow night at a private party, and we'll see how that goes. So thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. I love you guys, and I'll see you later. Bye!